Welcome back guys, how you all doing? My name is Marks and this is Daybound episode 17. Alright, so we're starting this episode off in someone else's base. So we are here at Orbney's because um, we actually did a little something for Orbney off camera because he left some diamond in his trees. So these, this tree just here is completely custom. Um, it was an azalea tree anyway, and I turned it into a bigger, nicer azalea tree than what was here. And yeah, I quite happily took the uh, three diamond blocks that were in here. So hopefully Orbney is happy with this tree. That leaf is kind of bugging me. Um, but then as well, we've got one just around this corner which again completely custom as earlier tree it was an oak originally i did it so it was kind of more well, leaning over this way and growing away from the barn because yeah it kind of just made sense rather than poofing it out all the way over here that is a lot of skeleton horses wow um so yeah that's the whole ideal with this so orbney if you're watching this yes it was me who Built you the trees because I want the free money. It was easy money, so why not? Um, but yeah, this episode may actually be the last proper episode of this season because, uh, as most of you are very aware, one nineteen is coming around and we are starting fresh from one nineteen. Um, so we will be saying goodbye to this world. It will be saved, obviously. Uh, we'll have a world download for at least ourselves that we'll discuss whether we'll make it public or not. But with that being said, we need to actually... Um, well, yeah, we don't actually really have a base. So but we're going to do an awful lot in, in this one. We're, we're going to build a good chunk of our base. So let's head over to the base and start working on at least the entrance. Here's a time lapse. Hope you enjoy. finished clock is in place uh not got it working at the minute because it apparently needs two people to actually set it up all the redstone is behind it hidden away um but it's just kind of fixed at the minute because yeah no one well my camera account's on but um yeah no one else is on to be able to uh help with that and it's kind of difficult to do it with two people so with the uh, two two accounts but yeah, here we have the entrance to um, our actual base storage, I guess, because the whole area is supposed to be the base. And we threw this tree up as well, because why not have a giant spruce? I need to replace some of the others with spruces as well. Um, but as it stands at the minute, it's literally just the entrance. We come in, um, we're going to have a tunnel break through to in here and then the storage is going to be in here how exactly that's going to be i have no idea just yet but we'll do we'll think of something i mean we've got five days it's fine um yeah as well we, we need to do some bits and bobs here so i've got an idea for what we can put here hence the um white wall uh, and there's a couple, there's a light design I've got as well, just to light this area up a bit because we are getting mobs and stuff. But we're going to have a staircase just here, kind of all exposed. I'll probably have to replace some of this with other bits and bobs. But then coming up here, again, we're going to have another structure in this face just here. Um, maybe throw a tree up on this corner, I don't know. And then the stairs are going to come up 
And this is all to get into the base. And it's going to essentially just be a tunnel system coming through here. And we're going to have like some big window things. I'm going to have to cut this back a little bit. Uh, so it's just going to pop through here all the way down and out through this way. Uh, now, that is pretty much the run we've got to that. We're going to have the storage done. I'm going to pop some other bits and bobs up around as well. Um, I think more than anything, it's probably going to all be off camera just because it was just going to be a series of really short time lapses of different areas and not very easy to show. I'm only really going to be able to show that bit just there. So, yeah, there may be a couple of other things I throw up as well. I've got an idea for something just there. Um, I've got this really big gear design, which I want to put in somewhere. Just don't know where. I might put it on there and just wing it. I don't know, just as something there. Um, it could be like powering some big engine or something. I don't, I don't know. Or like, yeah, we'll see. Then I need something on top. Oh, I don't know. Um, but yeah, that is, that is the idea for what we've got. As I said, uh, I think in the past, because of how late it is now, I don't think I'm going to get a chance to do the sail punk side of it so it is literally just going to be the structure around um but i might be able to transition that into my starter for next season we'll see just so we we're kind of completing the whole steampunk thing that i i have planned for this um but yeah we'll uh we'll crack on and i will show you the finished product once everything is done and give you a tour so i'll see you then Right, so there we have it, a couple of days worth of hard work, and it's kind of at a place I'm happy to leave it in, um, I guess. I didn't have enough time to um, to do the actual storage area within the base. Um, I kind of focused too much on the external part and lost track of time. But yeah, it's fine. It, it mostly looks all right, and... There's loads of storage in there, not that there's anything in there, because it's pretty much all at the start of base in Dearborn Village. So, in terms of what we've actually done here, the big gear, you know, that's kind of obvious, and the trees and things. Um, but yeah, we've gone around, we, we've added in like fauna and, and stuff and flowers and, and whatnot. We've got the power supply, at least to this building, going off here. And then, as... Oh yeah, brush plate. Um, I think as I mentioned, um, coming up here, we you know we've detailed it all. We've got the stairs coming up, and we had this weird we had a weird space here that um, I kind of just put in this. Essentially, it's a lava generator, um, and it kind of it kind of just looks like it's pumping it in from within the mountain, I guess, kind of. Um, that sort of makes sense, I suppose. Um, but then following that, coming up here, we've got the path through and uh, so it's a so bleed over from there coming to they're just kind of like carved out into um tunnel that came through we've got you know viewing out here which someone's blocked with the house you can see straight into the bedroom that's um uh, yeah not not weird at all um but yeah just coming through here you know, as you can see it's just kind of like built into the actual Hill itself, and then coming up, you know, got like a little bit of dirt spilling down the stairs, I suppose. And then we come up here to the grand entrance into what would have been our storage. And um, I did make an effort at doing this. I you know I got so far in, and then just yeah, as I said, ran out of time. And um, so we would ha would have had like the big hall in here with all all the storage and whatnot. And, different bits and bobs in here um but unfortunately yeah just don't have the time before 119 drops and going into season two to do that unfortunately um speaking of that yet yeah, there is going to be a season two albany let us know that in a few episodes past um so we will be going there fresh seed with most of the people uh that have been active since um 
if for the most part we we completely transformed this this place i mean it was a forest we got rid of all the oak and birch and stuff that was around uh replaced all the dirt you could see with um coarse dirt and moss and stuff and then obviously we've got the the spruce trees with the pod soil and mushrooms that are going absolutely wild and yeah there's a lot more i'd have liked to have done i'd have liked to have got more trees and not denser um but like covered more area around here i got a few more builds around obviously don't like the the sail punk stuff and things that i wanted to do with like essentially delivery and transport and stuff um which is unfortunate but it is what it is but yeah that's uh that's the base that's that's what we finished with in the end um unfinished but more finished than it was i guess i'm happy with it it looks nice and yeah i i, I think we can happily leave it there so with that said i will see you all in season two ciao for now bye bye